Good timing, lad. I sent two of my best knights into parley with the orc leader. They should be returning shortly. Damn. These orcs will never surrender. Then let's get in there and destroy the beasts. Remember, Argus, we are paladins. Vengeance cannot be a part of what we must do. If we allow our passions to turn to bloodlust, we will become as vile as the orcs. Yes, Uther. Now, if you're feeling up to it, I want you to lead the attack. Me? Well, of course. I'll remain here and ensure that none of the loathsome beasts threaten the camp. I won't fail you. I know you won't, lad. Now, going back a little bit to the more traditional Warcraft style of base against base, here we have our base, and there is another that the orcs have. So we're going to want to uh, destroy it, really? Well, no, you don't actually... I don't think you have to destroy the enemy base in order to win this mission. You just have to go out there and... Um, you just more or less have to get out there and defeat a certain individual enemy that we're going to encounter. Now, uh, we have... Okay, I'm going to send Arthas out here alone and leave the defense of the base to Uther, um, Uther here. Because I don't, I don't have a lot of time to take care of some extra stuff before the game starts to get crazy. And Uther will be able to sort of... Well met, good human. Have you come to join in our hunt? What are you dwarves hunting in this region? We're hunting black drakes. It's said the drake's blood can bestow fiery enchantments upon weapons. The fiery enchantments you seek could prove useful. The name of the beast we're hunting is Cyrenox. With your aid, the monster won't stand a chance. I'm here to help. Okay, even if I didn't really want to complete this mission, coming over here will get me four of these uh, dwarf and gunner riflemen. Our town is under siege. Uther will take care of them. And I'll send a peasant to go and repair the towers. Of course. I want to take care of this as soon as possible so we can get Arthas back on the defense of the uh, city. Now, Arthas can't actually attack that dragon there. A sound plan. Our town is under siege. A sound plan. Forces are under attack. What? Right then. The light is my strength. For honor. I just want to make sure that. A sound up, Cyrano. Immortals become more reckless with every generation. This might take a little bit of uh, work. So, Arthas is going to have to put a lot of effort into keeping these guys alive. Because only the riflemen can attack this hero unit here. Oh. I think it's pretty important to make sure that Arthas' healing ability gets upgraded as, quick, as quickly as possible. Replace the tower that was destroyed. Ah, farm. What? Off I go then. I need Arthas to turn that in. He'll get a special item which will increase his stats. Of course. And then I'll put him back on the defense of the town. A sound plan. Job's done. Now I will reforge our weapons to strike with searing heat. Well, hurry it up. Our town is under sea. Build more farm. What is it? All right. The light is Job's my done. Horses are under attack. More work. Right here. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Uther is actually healing the the peasants. 
stand. Now Arthas is back, we can mount a proper defense. Because I didn't really have any units other than Arthas defending this place, and that seems like a bad idea, doesn't it? Okay, I'm just going to go and upgrade this to a guard tower so it can be used for defense again. And Arthas here, along with his new uh, riflemen, should be good enough to defend this town. Now we do see Arthas is um, not quite the uh, peaceful fellow that perhaps uh, Uther is. Well Arthas is younger, and I guess he never really saw the the first war, so he's right. may just be eager to prove himself. But sort of uh, violent tendencies isn't appreciated by his uh, his superior here. Justice shall be done. So the level ten uh, Uther Paladin, level ten. Look at uh, his stats in comparison I'm here to, help. to Arthas here. Forty six plus 5 strength, compared to Arthas, who's only 28. Though he does have some of these extra items to give him some boosts, uh, Arthas is nowhere near the strength of Uther. Okay, our guard towers are in place. Uh, so we're ready to do a proper defense. Now I just want to go and... Well, easy. Job's done. What else can I build around here? I'm not sure an altar of kings is really necessary, which will resurrect, which we can be used to resurrect a fallen hero unit like Arthas. Not really necessary, but it could do it anyway, I guess. Uh, what's down here? Is this anything? Am I missing anything? I'm gonna send Arthas down there to check it out. Uh, okay, I can train my footman now. I'm here to help. For honor. I guess there is nothing down here. <laughs> Certainly. Or it's nighttime. You can't see. But there is nothing down here. We're good. A sound plan. Ready for action. Once I get my six footmen, that should be enough for me to lead an attack strong enough to take out the enemy base if I were uh willing to do that. I already have an altar of kings. I was gonna build one too. Oh, I'm an idiot. Ready for action. I stand for the life. Order. Let me out. I'm here to help. Ready for action. Job done. Uh, I need more farms before I can continue to Whoa. build crap. Uh, it takes forever. Off I go, then. Something you can do to mount a proper defense. Something I don't do as much in this game as I did in like Warcraft 1 or 2. Is to form ranks. Like, assuming that this is where all the attacks are going to be coming from, I can set all my melee units up in the front, then take my ranged units and form the second rank behind them. So that way, any attack will be attacked by the ranged units while coming in this direction, and then will hit, uh, hit the melee units as they get closer and hopefully be killed before they can do any substantial damage. It's nothing for this guy to build. Go back to doing whatever you're doing. Yes, my, lord. Uh, my last uh, my last of the units are being built. Ready so we're good. Research what do you need? Of course. You have a target? I'm your shooter. I Alright, this should be good enough. I'm going to take these guys ahead. Oh, there's an attack. Ready for action. <laughs> the, uh, as is typical for a lot of RTSs, the enemy base will constantly just, or uh, periodically go and spawn new attack waves to go and attack your base. 
That way you have to put effort into defending it rather than just trying to build up your strength. For honor. Yes, my liege. I'm going to leave these guys to the defense just in case an attack occurs while I am out doing what I'm going to do. Of course. Paladin fool! The warlocks of the Black Rock Clan have spoken. Soon, demons will rain from the sky, and this wretched world will burn. Yes, I've heard this rhetoric before. You orcs will never burn. It was only a mirror image. Damn it, what are these curves up to? The hour of doom approaches. Let this paltry sacrifice appease our demon masters. You sick bastards. Never get away with this. Slay the orcs. Slay them all. Yeah, alright. The orcs were, in the earlier games, sort of partial to sort of dark evil magics and stuff. Of course. So, having that, it got written a little bit more into the story of this game than it was into the previous ones, but apparently the orcs, even though a lot of them, like Thraw and stuff, have sort of turned their back on that kind of thing, there do seem to be quite a bit of orcs, especially these Black Rock Clan orcs that are um, still doing that. Now, the enemy base is up here. I'm not going to destroy that right now. I'm going to go right over here and try to take out the blade master which is doing all the evil which i believe will end this mission rather than having to go through all the effort of destroying the actual enemy base if i were to destroy the enemy base it would stop the attacks on mine though so it doesn't really uh, doesn't really make a huge difference i think about what you go and do a sound plan. There's the Blade Master. He's a level two, so he's not a big deal. Certainly. Another hero unit, a proper hero unit. Justice. Ah, the abilities of the Blade Master. I think this is the real one. So I'm gonna focus my attacks on that one. It's hard to tell. Whichever one takes damage slower is the real one. You've done well, lad. This was a sound victory. I don't know, Uther. The orcs were sacrificing townsfolk. I think they were trying to summon demons. Have faith, lad. These orcs are trying to hold on to dying traditions. We defeated their demons a long time ago. Let's head for home. It's been a long day. <laughs> 